Brian Ortega put himself back in featherweight title contention after an impressive submission victory over Yair Rodriguez at UFC Fight Night 237. The American was out for revenge against Rodriguez having lost their first clash by TKO back in 2022 when he suffered a dislocated shoulder in the first round. And Ortega did just that after choking out his opponent in the third round of their fight at the Mexico City Arena in Mexico City. Ortega hadn't fought since that defeat in July 2022 and has endured a difficult period in his career, failing to win since he beat Young Chan Sung by unanimous decision in October 2020. In a chaotic 15-minute bout, Ortega, who seemed to pick up an ankle injury as he warmed up, took some early blows from Rodriguez and was sat down after taking one particular big hit. But he improved and managed to control round two, landing several heavy blows of his own and cutting Rodriguez in the process. He then pounced in round three as Ortega locked in the choke after taking Rodriguez down to secure revenge. Ortega, who later revealed he had been suffering with a twisted ankle, received a dressing down from referee Mark Goddard for a delay in the release of the submission, with the 33-year-old apologetic. An emotional and pumped-up Ortega then proceeded to celebrate with his family in the crowd. It was a big result for the American, who ended a two-fight losing streak and extended his MMA record to 16-3. The victory also puts him back in title contention against the new UFC featherweight champion Ilya Topuria, who stunned Alexander Volkanovsky with a second-round knockout at UFC 298 last week. Meanwhile, it was a huge blow for former interim champion Rodriguez's title prospects after his previous bout saw him lose to Volkanovsky at UFC 290 last July.